and welcome to the Central Coast. Life after Marcus Babel begins for the Western Sydney Wanderers. It is 10th, playing host to 9th. A win for either side and they will leapfrog the Melbourne victory into 8th and have a game in hand on that club as well. Four wins each throughout the season for the Mariners and the Wanderers. Bit of change going on with both of these clubs in terms of personnel as well. Galifawoko has departed. What can Muller do here? Oh, nutmeg and across the face. He can't find the bottom corner. We're goalless through the opening half hour somehow. Here's a chance though. Muller puts the Wanderers in front. The Mariners had their pants pulled down. Murray helping it on. Simon shielding it away. And Murray brings out the best in Lopa. Good shoulder to shoulder work from Jurich. Then he got excited, went for goal from the narrow angle when he had teammates in the middle. And another chance goes to waste. And wasn't anticipating that pass. Gets it gifted to him by Jurich, though. Cox just on. Schwiegler hits the bar. That close to doubling the Wanderers' advantage. Birigetti could only watch. Cox may have strayed. Now he's onside, though. Chance for a goal on Dabu. He's won a penalty. It has to be. He was caught on the wrong side. It was Tommy Orr. They complained about the offside, but it's not a factor now because the header came from the defender. Duke off two or three steps. V. Birigetti, who denied him. About 10 minutes ago now. Mitch Duke, old cheeky. Dinks it over the top of Birigini this time. And the Wanderers 2-0 up in Gosford. And on course for a win first up under their new coach. Now to end of the final 10 minutes. A couple of late goals. Took them past the Melbourne victory for a famous win not that long ago at this venue. 100. 10th minute winner from this man who's won a penalty. Matt Simon makes the most of a clumsy challenge from Pierman and Schwiegler. And we've got spot kicks at both ends now. So Simon v. Lopar sends him the wrong way and it's game on again. Penalties at that end for the Central Coast Mariners. It's done the business before for them. It's been a wonderful game of football. Two teams at the wrong end of the table, but they've really given everything here today. Oh, right foot delivery, finds Simon. Layoff for Jair. Wide to Miller. Ruiz Diaz with the header. Oh, what a save! Lopa flying through the air like Superman to keep it out. Brilliant football all round. And here we go, because this is the test for the Wanderers. They've answered a couple of the questions put to them. How well can you play? Can you get a couple of goals? Now the most pressing test is how tough are you between the ears, late in the game. Bacchus, terrific return from him after the time in Thailand with the Oli Roos. Well, Adam picked the right pass this time. Cox wants it pulled back a little. He finds Muller. One touch stuff, and it's a goal on debut for Simon Cox to finish it all off. Western Sydney three, the Central Coast Mariners one. And what a goal that was easy on the eye to finish it all off. The end of Babel's rabble and the start of JP De Marini's spell in charge ends with three points and three goals for Western Sydney. Victory on the Central Coast and now a derby to look forward to.